morning in glorious Colorado and I'm just out here on my patio because it's kind of chilly and it's trying to rain it's been raining all morning you know what it doesn't matter one thing I wanted to bring about today a thought pattern that you might want to give a little more thought to is what we think about is what really does happen in our lives whatever we focus on whether it's good or bad I have to tell you a story because this will help illustrate that I truly do try to put this into my own life and I do have a reason why I do that and that is that my mother this this uh, this uh, November 3rd is actually the anniversary of our funeral that we had for my mother uh, and when she died in 2011 in a couple of weeks I will have all my family here and we will celebrate life we will not celebrate death. And yes, we'll think about her and the good things that she did in her life that were important to us. We will not focus on the things. So I've got to tell you the story so that you understand where I'm coming from. My mother died of the complications of, of uh, diabetes and congestive heart failure. She had several heart attacks. She had some strokes. She was not well. She was not doing that well, but then on the other hand, she had the ability when she wanted to, when she put her mind to it, to do some things with her life. I tried to teach her several times to get on the computer, to, to learn how to search her family, to do emails to her family, to do whatever she wanted. She could write her story. I, I worked with her on that, but she could write her story. I ended up doing most of it because she really did not have the will to live any longer. And that is the key piece here, is that if you complain and you, co and, you, and you talk about all the things that are going wrong, eventually that's all you will see is what's going oh, wrong. The reality is they will have those kinds of situations where there's people that are not good in their life or situations that are not. So do we focus on just the things that are bad? No. We do take enough time to resolve if we can or to move on if we can that is what we do for instance with my mother she actually spent the last year and a half of her life talking about dying talking about wanting to die and yes she was sick and yes she wasn't feeling the greatest but I do believe that she gave up the chance to actually live fully, even though she was ill, for that last period of her life. And I vowed at that point, I would never let that happen in my life. Regardless of whether I am well or sick, I will not live in a, a state of being ready to die. Think about that for a minute. Are you living in a state of being ready to die or are you living in a state of being willing to live your fullest life whatever that is that is the difference between those thought patterns and they create different results I am not ready to die and I'm not going to be thinking along those lines anytime soon until the very moment that that is what happens and when the Lord decides to take my spirit away from my body and create death then and only then will I be worried about dying I am going to live my fullest life and I recommend that you do too I hope this has been helpful and I do have some things that I can share with you on the bottom of this video